Hello everybody, today we are going to talk about constant instances of classes and about the constant method. We will see what will happen when we precede that things with the word constant. Let's imagine a situation like that. We want to create a class that will represent a position of a, an object, whatever object. It can be a dog, it can be home, house, right? It can be anything. Uh, so we'll create a class and we call it position. And well, I can't click the space here uh, because comp our ID will use the hint here. Okay, so class position. Remember about semicolon here. And now we need to store position somewhere. So let's store it in two private variables x and y. Then we'll create in the public section by using the public modifier two constru uh, well, constructor and destructor. So constructor position and this constructor will take two uh, parameters. So int int for because we need to construct the position here, right? And of course, we'll create the destructor. And now let's create a definition for the things here. So, position, and we are taking the position, int x and int y. And now we'll use the this address, right, that will help us get to the x that we are working on right now, and we will assign here x. So now we don't need to think about new name for x and y, right, I don't need to here type something like a and v, uh, I, I can use the same names for variables, because we can use the this thing. And of course we create the definition of destructor and now let's create an object so position and we call it doc and we will assign here position at the beginning for example 10 and 50 now it will be nice if we had a function that we could let us get the x and y so uh, let's return the void so nothing and now get position we call that thing like that and uh, here we will not take any parameters and let's define that guy here void position get position and let's just send to the output the information about it so include the IO stream we need to use also the namespace std and now here we'll send to the output C out the X and Y position. We could of course do it a bit different way, but right now I just want to make it as easy as possible. And now we just get duck get position and let's build and run that program. As you can see the position is 10 and 50. So now uh, let's maybe create a function that will change the position, so set position and it will take two arguments void position set position and now I will assign to x, x and to y y that coming from here. And now dog is an animal, right? So he can move easily. So I can move him for example to the place like that and then the get position and everything should work fine for a dog, right? And everything works fine. But hmm, 
What about a situation like that? I'm creating a position for the house and in the beginning we are creating the foundations of our house for example 100 200 and this is the position for our house and of course we could create the wave and other things like that but the most important thing about the house is that <laughs> how to move a house right when we create the foundations it, uh, we would have to destroy the house to move it right so house is not movable now and but i want to keep that guy movable within the same class right how to do that because now when we do something like that so let's change that thing to the house so i'm moving it for example to the place like that it can happen but it's not right we should be able to say hey i am going to make you constant here so i'm now making the constant variable of our type but there is a problem when we do something like that everything within the class is being made instantly constant it means that we can't use any function also so now we can't even the get position block get position is not working also if we want to let a function to be used when there is constant before the type of our uh, of our class we should add here something like constant the word after the declaration okay and also of course here and then the get position will work so it's okay because we should be able to get position right it's good but we shouldn't be able to set position because set position is wrong so set position is not working and as you can see when a uh, dog is working fine with get position and set position but the house is working only well with get position so everything is working fine like we wanted to okay so the user of our well the programmer of our uh, uh, the programmer that will use the class our class uh, will be able to decide on his own hey I will just create this guide x constant and now I know that I can get position because here is a work constant but I won't be able to set position so everything works fine like I want okay that's all in that lesson thank you very much